Hello everyone, and welcome to my The Bold and the Beautiful official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Deacon's second betrayal rocks Shayla. Turns fiancé over to cops after reform fails on the bold and the beautiful. Spoilers for the bold and the beautiful suggest that Deacon Sharp might be mistaken regarding Shayla Carter's level of rehabilitation. Sheila just cannot be trusted, despite Deacon's conviction that she has learned her lesson and will never intentionally hurt anyone again. Of course, in the episode from October 9, Deacon sought to reassure John Finn Finnegan by saying he could handle Shayla. Steffi Forrester included, Deacon argued that he would make sure Shayla never again injured anyone. Finn questioned Deacon's capability as a result, but Deacon clarified that he was a black belt in karate. Deacon honestly thinks Shayla has changed for the time being, yet it's obvious that he feels prepared to handle her if she starts acting inappropriately once more. Sheila has already said a few fairly unsettling things about getting Steffi out of the way, so according to B and B spoilers, trouble may be brewing. Her rehabilitation is irrelevant since Finn will never let Shayla into his life as long as Steffi remains a factor. It's unlikely that Steffi will ever accept Shayla into the family or think she has changed. In other words, Deacon is free to assert that Shayla has changed if he so chooses, but this has no bearing on Finn's family situation. Sheila has a reason to want Steffi gone for good since Finn can't be connected to her if he wants to make his marriage work. Sheila has demonstrated that when it comes to remaining on the right track, she is her own greatest adversary. Sheila always gives in to her worst instincts and does something regrettable sooner or later. Could he be obliged to take harsh action against his own fiancé in light of Deacon's comment about making sure Sheila never injured anyone again? Deacon could need to use force to restrain Shayla in some circumstances, even if doing so puts Shayla in danger of harm or a terrible end. Deacon might also give Shayla over to the police and betray her once more. The first time was when Deacon assisted Bill Spencer and Ridge Forrester in locking Shayla up, but it's clear that a strategy didn't work for very long. Deacon would feel guilty if Shayla eventually goes rogue and endangers individuals like Steffi, because he subsequently assisted in getting her freedom. Deacon might then intervene to stop Shayla before it's too late as a result. Stay with us for updates on the potentially disastrous news that may be on the horizon as the bold and the beautiful spoilers indicate that Shayla may put her relationship with Deacon to the test. CTL will have additional thrilling. Taylor Hayes will need to make another trip now that she's back in Los Angeles, according to Thursday's The Bold and the Beautiful Spoilers. Taylor will apparently visit Forrester Creations to meet up with Ridge Forrester and Brooke Logan. Given that Brooke and Ridge frequently share kisses at work, Taylor might accidentally witness them. Of course, Taylor will give an update on how Steffi Forrester and the children are doing abroad before the topic of Shella Carter is brought up. According to B&B teasers, Ridge will berate Finn for not recognizing Shayla's manipulation of John Finn Finnegan. Taylor may contend that Finn is aware of the issues at hand, but she will also question if he will be able to successfully remove his biological mother from his life. The onus of demonstrating his ability to keep Shayla away from Steffi and the kids is on Finn, even though Taylor paid him a visit and vehemently begged him to defend his family. Along with Ridge's worries about why Eric Forrester is so intent on this, Taylor may also learn about Eric Forrester's own Kucha line. Ridge consented to a fashion challenge, but now that Carter Walton has revealed how expensive Eric's collection is turning out to be, he is having second thoughts. Taylor is expected to learn about Thomas Forrester and Hope Logan's, Annika Noel, relationship before the week is up, so Brooke might possibly let Taylor in on it. Before informing Taylor that they need to put an end to this, Brooke can admit to spying Hope and Thomas together more than once. Deacon Sharp will make a decision that will alter his life while Taylor deals with that shock. Deacon stopped Sheila as she was about to leave and stated he didn't want to be alone any longer. Deacon seems to have given up on attempting to avoid Sheila, thus he is willing to pursue their relationship despite the dangers. 
According to the bold and the beautiful spoilers, a hasty marriage proposal will occur in the next few weeks. Therefore, it appears Deacon will propose the following week. Where you want to go for interesting things is CDL. Deacon Sharp expresses his opinion on B, and B Deacon has a lot of explaining to do, boy. There was also a great deal of appealing, begging, and bargaining. People are not only perplexed by his connection with Sheila, but they are also enraged by it, especially Finn and Hope. Deacon is hoping to at least demonstrate to Hope, his lover girl, that she has changed even though he may not be able to do anything to win Sheila's son around to their cause. Oh sure, thanks to his love, she has changed, has fully recovered, and will never ever ever be a problem again. Ah, love makes everything better. Hope wasn't born yesterday, which is unfortunate for Deacon, and she is not at all amused by this act. Not at all. If Deacon wants to allay Hope's concerns, he will need to use much more artistic language and promises. Or perhaps Deacon should reconsider their relationship. It's love in the air. Speaking of romance, RJ and Luna might soon fall in love. By the minute, if not the day, the two are then closer. Since she arrived in Forrester, they have nearly been attached at the hip, and it won't change any time soon, especially when they share a passionate kiss. If you've fallen behind on the bold and the beautiful, Soap Hub can help you catch up on all the most recent events in Los Angeles. We release weekly recaps every weekend that inform you of the most significant events and assist you in understanding the current state of the program. According to the bold and the beautiful spoilers on October 3, Deacon Sharp will beg Hope Logan to cool off so he can tell her how much Shayla Carter means to him. Hope simply won't believe Shayla is capable of becoming a moral person, despite Deacon's defense of the advances Shayla has made in her life. Hope will find it difficult to understand how her dad could be associated with someone so horrible, despite Deacon's persistent attempts to convince her. Even though she wasn't found guilty for them, Sheila has nevertheless committed some serious crimes. Deacon will undoubtedly want to keep Hope from knowing that he helped to ensure Sheila was free, and that's for the best. Deacon will only concentrate on attempting to calm Hope down and convey to her that love is a difficult thing but Hope will be quite clear that she doesn't and never will accept Shayla. Hope won't believe a word Shayla says and will never think she's good enough for Deacon, thus Shayla won't actually have a chance to say anything. Deacon will have to consider Hope's awful reaction and what it might mean for their relationship after she storms out of the flat. Deacon will presumably continue to suggest that Hope only needs time to warm up, despite Shayla's speculations to the contrary. Another tense showdown will be taking place at Forrester Creations in the meanwhile. During her visit, Lee Finnegan only just caught a glimpse of Luna Nozawa through the doorway of the design studio, so she addressed her niece. Now that Lai is going to demand information and let go her wrath, Luna will stand up for her desire to work for Forrester Creations. Lai won't want to hear it and will very certainly agree with Poppy that Luna has to leave Los Angeles. Fans will hopefully gain a better understanding of why Luna's presence in AA is so troublesome and why she is receiving so much Forrester blowback now, but it is evident that there are some severe family issues present. On Wednesday's b and episode, R.J. Forrester will run across John Finn Finnegan in the main office, who won't be aware that Lai and Luna are engaged in such a heated argument close by. R.G. will ask for updates on Finn's troubled marriage and may question if Finn is getting any closer to permanently removing Shayla from the picture. The success of Finn and Steffi Forrester's marriage rests on getting rid of Shayla. Yet, Finn may allude to certain difficulties, even if he withholds information concerning Shayla and Deacon's romantic relationship for the time being. R.G. will meet with Luna again later and discover that she is upset once more. R.G. will be suspicious whether or not he sees Luna with Eli and will reaffirm his willingness to listen if Luna wants to talk. According to the bold and the beautiful spoilers, Luna will allow herself to be carried away in a kiss as she falls even more in love with R.J., but the revelation of her dysfunctional family may cause problems in the road. For thrilling experiences, head to CDL. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel 
and don't miss any update.